I know how to paint you guys. So if anyone needs <laughs> anything, wall paints, window paints, I'm around. <laughs> Hi, I'm Marina Shake, and today I'm gonna let Elle ask me anything. What does a typical day look like for me? Well, I get up at 7 a.m., very last minute, cook my daughter breakfast, prep her for school, bring her to school, go work out, do my appointments, pick her up from school. So it's basically my schedule surrounded with my daughter's schedule. But if my daughter is on with me, I love to be in bed till 10 a.m. and have a breakfast in bed. Easy. <laughs> hmm. I would probably say Jane Fonda. You know, I think she's so much fun and she has a great sense of humor. So, Jane Fonda. Who is my biggest inspiration in the fashion industry? It's my dear friend, Ricardo Tisha. He's so amazing and he's so much fun. He's so creative. He's definitely, you know, a biggest inspiration of young generation and Edward Ellington because I think he brought a new wave of new vision into a fashion. Donatella Versace, she's a strong, powerful woman. The best advice I've ever received from my mom, take no and turn into a yes. And I'm a Capricorn, so I'm very stubborn. How do I respond to negative? I think I just take everything with kind of like sense of humor, you know? I love to laugh with my friends and make fun of myself and my friends. So I don't know, I think there is no space of negativity in my life and I'm kind of concentrated only on the positive. What's my favorite thing about motherhood? It's the honesty of my daughter. She would call me in anything I would do. She likes to make fun of me in a like silly, funny way. I think it's the best because she's just very straight honest and she's really funny and she's like my best friend. My favorite look that I wore on a red carpet, I think what I wore for a red carpet in Cannes Festival, Molola, I love her. I think she is the new vision of young generation and it was like this leather skirt and kind of like crop top. It was like very open and a little bit provocative and sexy for the red carpet. But I think she woman who understands woman. Do I have fashion regrets? I kind of don't have any regrets. I think it sounds a little silly, but it's like, I think you learn from your mistakes. And there is so many pictures out there where I look and I was like, it's absolutely not me. <laughs> but at least you have something to laugh about, right? So no regrets. My first ever job, I was painting a hospital room for like 31 days because I wanted to get a high heel shoes. It was my summer job and I got like $8 for a whole month. It was pretty harsh, you know, because you have to like paint from eight to five every day. And now I know how to paint you guys. So if anyone needs <laughs> anything, wall paints, window paints, I'm around. <laughs> My first ever money that I got, I was working in some exhibition, like some crazy hours. I think it was like seven day job and it was like hundred dollars paid and it was a lot of money for me. And my mom wanted a new sofa. So I collected this money and I sent it to her and she got a new sofa and she was so excited. So that was my first ever money spent on my mom's sofa. I wish we had it, the sofa, but we don't. <laughs> I think cat or dogs and feel on it or something like that. I grew up playing piano and singing in choir. Don't ask me to sing because it would not be cute right now for sure. My mom is a classical pianist and I think what made me fall in love with music and is hearing her playing piano every day. I mean, of course, Tchaikovsky, Mozart, Beethoven, like classical music is definitely made me fall in love with music. And now music, it's, you know, my everyday life. When I wake up with the music, I go to bed listening music. So, yeah. If I would only have three things in the fashion wardrobe, I mean, sweatpants. <laughs> well, I wore sweatpants for Matt Gala after party. I just love to be comfortable. I know this is not what everyone wanna hear, but I definitely need sweatpants in my closet. A little black dress that you can reuse it. I love recycling clothes. So black little dress, sweatpants, and some comfortable shoes. 
What's my ever favorite fashion piece that I own? Okay, I shouldn't say that, but I'm really big at taking shoes from a fashion shows. Okay, so <laughs> when you <laughs> when you walk to my shoe closet, you can see shows that I did and shoes, you know? So if I do a show and there is shoe missing, do not call me, okay? <laughs> I'm not giving it back. So probably um, is this um, really cool Givenchy boots. They're kind of like high up the knee with like a color heel. I think it's, it was from like Egyptian collection. I love those shoes. I love, I love, I love it. So I'm definitely saving and passing it to my daughter. So it will probably be those. And I took them from the show. I'm really proud of it, by the way. <laughs> What is my bucket list? Well, kind of say like, don't tell your dreams, otherwise they don't come true. But a couple of photographers that I want to work with. And definitely on my bucket list is more travel. I've never been to Australia and New Zealand. And I want to go back to Madagascar because it's my favorite, favorite, favorite place to go. So definitely job goals, travel, and spend more time with my family. Yeah, that's my bucket list. My beauty mantra is definitely stay away from the sun, drink tons of water, and definitely a lot of sleep. When you rest it, you feel so much more energized. And I think just be happy, you know, because when you're happy, I think you glow from inside out. I'm really, really, really excited to shoot for Al. The team, the energy, a rainy day in New York, and just can't wait to see pictures. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and Elle today. Hope you guys had fun and check out my cover that is out now. <laughs>